Hey guys, this is Blake Skater 33 and you might be surprised because you're like, why am I doing a video? It's not Sunday. But this is kind of like a mini clip. Right now, I'm going to do a review on the Tech Deck bowl. Uh, so here it is. The only problem is it has no non-sliders. But it's pretty heavy, so it's really steep and it's plastic. So yeah, it's kind of hard to do with your fingerboard because it's built for tech decks, not for big fingerboards. See the difference? Here, I'm gonna stop and do a different view right now. A different view. Uh, here it is from an overtop. I do got stickers in there. This doesn't mess you up. This outer landing right here doesn't mess you up. It's like a pool. The see. And this doesn't mess you up at all right here. But it is kind of a really big size matter. Because. I can't do really anything going on. Maybe because I'm just going to vert skater, but... Yeah, uh... Other than the size, it's really nice. I skate it a lot with my fingerboard. But you see... A fingerboard... Or a tech deck is perfect. Because they're smaller. So yeah, I'm going to go back to the other view so I can give you some uh, nonsense fingerboards and foamation. Hey guys, I'm still here. Uh, so yeah, the review was pretty nice. And the uh, thing is really nice. I don't think they sell them anymore. Even if they did and you're into fingerboarding, I don't recommend buying them because they're just too big or too small. But maybe go on Black River ramps and buy some. But yeah, uh, oh yeah, my hand's still sprained. Kind of sucks. But in a couple days, I'm getting four decks. Uh, well, actually, I'm getting two kind of things. I'm getting a bunch of grip tape or slippy tape from I Eat Fingerboards. She's pretty sweet. She has really good grip, and she's sending me the new kind. It's not even out yet for liquid fingerboards, and it's going to go on all my decks. I'm getting seven sheets all together. And uh, the decks I'm getting, I'm getting four decks. Two of them are good, but one of the two good ones is not lacquered. I'm lacquering it. I'm putting it in her giveaway. She accepts my entry to, for me to put it in there so I can get subscriber, subscribers. And then the other two are kind of messed up, but I'll fix them up. And then from her, I'm also getting two or I mean four unfinished decks which I'm so excited about. Three of them I think I'm going to do regular shape. One of them I'm going to mix it up, kind of do something cool. But there will be traced out of my four corner deck. Uh, the five plies all, they have really cool plies. This one has really bad plies, if you know what I mean. It kind of sucks. But I'm getting really tired of this board. So after I uh, get my new boards, trace this all out. I will be repainting it, re it, take all the stickers off, and it will be up for sale. And uh, that's probably all the nonsense FB info for right now. And catch me on my Sunday shows. That's always a good thing. And sorry for this little slamma. It's kind of weird. It's pretty long, though. And there is one more thing. I want all of you guys to go to 55 MTV and watch the premiere back-to-back -back episodes of Rob Dyrdek's Fantasy Factory. It's a really good show. It's good if you're into skating. Yeah. So, uh, yep. And 
here is a little pant trick for you if I can get these shorts on. Let's bump. Okay, now I'm gonna, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna attempt a tray flip with these. Oh my god. Oh, these are so hard to move in. How about just like. Oh, yeah, I'm this. Ah, there we go. Panty, panty, panties. They're still for sale. Please buy them. Three bucks shipped. I'll see you guys on the flip side.